Good morning, everybody. Bonded Draconis here, and welcome back to the Dishong Challenge on day four in seven days. To be honest, we are not looking good. We have no food. We have no drinkable water, at least. <clears throat> and we still have quite a ways to go. As I thought. The only food that we currently have, let's scrap that, are rotten sandwiches. We've got some beer, we've got some fat, and we've got some cornmeal. And of course, we have murky water. What we don't have is a way to make the murky water into clean water, or a way to cook any food. Not that we have a whole lot of food that we can cook. And we have zombies that have been pounding me all night. So we are going to need to take care of them. Yes, I hear you somewhere. Hello, my dear. There's the morning's time, so they're less dangerous now. But we are now going to have to go downstairs to try and take care of them. So let's get rid of these guys before we do much of anything else. There's a spider. I was wondering where he was. Nothing. I was going <laughs> Die? Die? Ooh. M actual meat. At the very least, I think we can char that. Okay. That's good. Delivery is good. Because I think we can at least char that without. Hello. Um, without a, uh, grill. And if that's the case, damn. If that's the case, then we, we at least have food. Will you shut up? So, with that in mind, have any other zombies come in? I feel like if they had, they would have followed the gunshots. But let's make sure. Ooh. Oh, hi. Owie. There we go. Not great, but it's at least stuff. I know we can't go outside, but anyone else? There's someone. I'll wait until she comes in though, so that hopefully I can kill her and get anything that she drops. She's not going to come inside. I'm skirting the rules, I know, but I didn't actually go outside. So I didn't break the rules. Nothing more to find. I was hoping I'd left stuff behind. Besides, you know, this stuff. But I guess not. Come on. So as I understand it, there are some usable farm plots in here. 
I don't think there are any farm plots where I'm at though. So it's possible that we can plant food, but I'm not going to try to repair a plant. In fact, can I make a shovel? can I don't need arrows in my hot bar actually I wonder Ooh, is this a possibility can I collect these Cannot collect them, but can I make them? What do I need? Rotting flesh. I think I have some of that upstairs. So if I collect these, then theoretically I can just make plots. If I understand the rules of the mod correctly, I should if I can find a way to make blocks stick to the building without touching the ground then theoretically I should be able to uh, be able to build off the building outside I guess bonus if I don't have to go outside to harvest I don't know I hear beating I hear beating on something hello I don't see anybody but I hear them and you know what? Sometimes that's enough. Oh shit. Okay. Let me see if I can make farm plots and use them. Because that's actually rather important. And of course, uh, if I can, then I'll have, then I'll hate myself for not figuring it out sooner. Oh yeah, I've got some of that here. Oh, nitrate. All right, I can make two. Let's, why not? Um, we'll put these right here, I guess. I don't know if this is gonna work, but, and I have nothing in the way of seeds, but we're gonna try it anyway. Oh, there they are. No. Okay. Well, that's a problem. Cause right now, oh, is my health going down right now? Oh shit. Okay. Oh, I'm starving. That's why. I'm going to have to risk it. I'm going to have to risk the trots. Oh, okay. Well, that that's that's a bonus, I guess. Mm. But if my uh, food goes up, then my health should go up as well. At least that's the theory. Let's see if I can char this meat. Oh, I can. Yes, please. Because with the rotten sandwiches and, and things like that, it's an immediate reduction in health, but it does raise your health. So or your hunger bar. So theoretically, if that goes up high enough, you should start regaining health at 
essentially a, a, a slower rate, theoretically. So we're going to cook this meat and we're going to see if it helps. All right. Neg five water, but that's okay. All right. Health is already going up because we're over 30%. That's good. It hurts our water, but I'd rather hurt that than our health. <coughs> At least for now. I'm going to go up to the swimming pool area and I'll meet you there. Okay. I've just opened the door, the door to the swimming pool. I see the tourists there. Let's reload. And I think if there's any more in here, they are actually in the pool. We're going to try to sneak in and see. Okay, here we go. They are. So we're gonna run back to the, uh, Elevator. All right, I took a sneak peek. They're actually breaking through the doors, not the windows. So that's helpful. And here they come, I think. Come on. I didn't lose them because they're beating through stuff. Ah, hi. Tanky fucker. Take out the feral first. Ow! Oh shit! Fine. Ooh. A book. Is that it? No. I hear one more, and I do not. I have no inkling that we're going to make it past day four, but that's not going to stop us from trying. Where are you? You're beating through concrete somewhere. This, I think that was concrete. I heard breaking. You know what? We can head back downstairs. Oh no. Drink. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's very bad. Eat. 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 Mm. Okay. That'll give us some food and, and health back. But... Now we have no wood. None. Three bullets and two knives. And a zombie somewhere. Sounds close. Okay, they're down there, which is fine. Once I get far enough away, they'll, they'll give up the ghosts which I have reason to believe will be hello. No up here. Now I know there's another, uh, kitchen area, not far from here, but, oh no, I have 1% hydration.
Hello? Are you in here? I don't see you. They broke through here. Oh, that's because there was an open door there. And they're still busting through something. Can I drink this? I bet I could collect it. I can't drink it though. Shit. Okay, well, that's bad. All right, I can still go out this window. Oh no. Wow, okay, so, ah. So this is a world with nothing but Dishong. That's weird. No one, no birds, nothing. Okay. Oh, they must have all come through. Okay. Well, that's a bonus, but I don't think we have seven health. So unless I can find some food and food or something to drink up here, I really do believe we are screwed. So might as well go balls to the wall at this point. Hi. Yep, screwed. All right. Well, that was that. That was that. I thought I'd put this on permadeath. Oh, I'm back outside. Okay. So that is that. Uh, we kind of got a bad start though. So I'm going to go back and restart this after this death because I think it's doable if you get a better start. And now that I've read through more, I'm seeing that there's more to this mod than I originally thought. I kind of went into this whole thing blind. Like I didn't read any of the, really read any of the notes, uh, or at least the ones that I did were very, very few. And uh, I didn't know some of the stuff then that I know now, like there are, I guess, some farm plots within that uh, you can use. And also right there, that's right about where I died. So we were only about halfway up the building. That's sad. And I, I think I'm going to cut down these trees when I start again, because you might not be able to dig or mine under the building, but that doesn't mean that you can't take down the trees in front of it. The challenge only starts once you go inside the building. So when we come back in, we're going to do things a little differently. We're going to start a little differently. So thank you guys for watching. I know this was a short one, but I really didn't think we were going to make it past day four when I saw where we were anyway. So here's to a better start the next time around. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.